I wanted to re-emphasize this for my insiders club. I've had a couple people um, that have really enjoyed the 360 program and things like that, that really talk about how to have match play strategy. One, I want to mention his name, Axel Kerr, who plays in Australia. He was writing me in about his club championship when he, he was leading the tournament, came into the last round, played terrible on the front nine, shot an unbelievably terrible score, came to the back nine, and he had a little pep talk with himself. And he was saying, you know, listen, I'm not out of this yet. You know, I've played three great rounds, one bad nine holes. I'm not out of this. I know I can play good golf. And he said something to his opponent. He said, hey, I'm coming for you. All right. And his opponent laughed at him. He's like, oh, whatever. You, don't, you know, you played so bad. You're so far out of it. And this kind of gave Axel this little uh, energy that he needed. And he ended up, he, it was oddly enough, he played unbelievable. I don't even want to say a score because you might think I'm lying. It's on the Insiders Club, um, a weird way to end the year. But you know the score he shot, he was able to come back. He just let his opponent know that he was still there. After he made a few birdies, he's like, I'm still here. I'm still coming for you. It got his opponent to start thinking about what he's doing. And he had a situation there where Axel made birdie and his opponent, I think, made double bogey. And his opponent started thinking, wow, I just lost three shots there. Axel was able to come back and win on the last hole of that deal. Another person, Jerry Peterson, a great guy out of Nebraska. One of the things he was doing with match play is he had this last tournament and he said, look, all I'm going to do, I'm up in the match, I'm going to hit fairways and greens. And what he really, you know, we talked on the phone the other day and he was saying that, you know, this guy really started pressing. He started going for shots and when he did that, he started making bogeys and so he won easily at the end of the match because this guy started forcing it. Even for a tour player, it's very difficult for them to make things happen. So understand in match play, guys, let your opponents know you're there if you're down. Let them know you're still coming for them. Let him think about score. The other thing is, in match play, make sure you hit a lot of fairways and greens. Even if that means not hitting driver, hit the ball in play. Make your opponent come catch you. Lots of fairways, lots of greens. That is the key to playing really good match play. Being in the hole every round, or being in the, mat, in the hole every hole, because then your opponent has to try to force things to do. And amateur golfers really aren't skilled enough to be able to force things to happen. Use those little keys, and I want to reemphasize that. Use those keys, and you'll win a lot more matches.